I'm Kaylin. I'm a high school senior from Nazareth, Pennsylvania. Wow, you look like a princess. I am a princess. Oh. Kendra. When I was six months old, my dad left, and I haven't seen him since. My mom's always struggled to hold down a steady job, boyfriend, and home. If I had to rely on my mom, I'd be lost. Thankfully, I met my boyfriend, Joe. You know I love you, right? Yeah, I know. We've been dating for nine months, and since I had nowhere else to live, his family invited me to move in with them. Are you gonna cut it? Since my mom's rarely around, Joe's mother, Janet, is like a second mom to me. Good job, go ahead, keep cutting it. Ever since Joe and I started sharing a bedroom, we've been really cramped, and it's caused a lot of tension. You can have that for me, And things are about to get even more crowded, because I'm pregnant. Seven, eight, nine, ten, good. Keep breathing. Good. And push. Oh, you're doing fabulous, honey. Hold my foot, Joe. Okay, honey. One more right on top of it. Go ahead, Kayla. Go ahead, keep pushing. You can do it, baby. Push, push, push. Okay, you're doing it, honey. It's okay. It's okay. It's a boy! It's a boy! You did it on me! Jason job. Oh my god! Oh, you're so cute! Oh, let's cut the cord. Oh, baby. Did you poop? Oh, you're at Daddy's house, so Daddy gets to change you. Despite our differences, I'm glad Joe and I can get along. Work is going well, and tonight I'm going bowling with Gigi and some of her friends. Hey. Hey. All right, guys, this is Kale. These are my friends, Kyle, Javi, Zal, and Lydia. We can ask them if they'll open another lane. Do you want to do that or no? Yeah, we're going to do teams. It's going to be Sal and Gigi, Kyle and Lydia, me and you. Oh. Sorry. I'll just get a strike it's every right, time. Yeah. It's all right. No big deal. No big deal. Oh, yeah. Sit. I'm on your neck. She gets a spare. There it is. Good hit. Nice. I have one left. Good job. Job. It's great getting out of the house to have fun. And Gigi's friend Javi is kind of cute. Isaac's with Joe over the weekend. Bye-bye. Yeah, Daddy's got to get your shoes still. Baby. Meanwhile, Javi asked me if I wanted to hang out today, and I'm kind of excited to spend more time with him. Hey. Hi. So how are you? I'm good. Yeah? It's good to see you. Did you have fun the other night? Yeah, I had a blast. Oh, good. Oh, yeah. I haven't bowled in so long. Definitely got to do it again, but not bowling. We can do something more, more exciting. So how's school? What are you studying? Marketing. Oh, nice. That's What good. are you going to school for? Criminal justice. Yeah, ultimately, oh, good. Ultimately, I want to be a cop. Good. Be how far along, how much longer do you have to go for? Oh, a long time. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Good plan. So are you seeing anyone now? No. I was with someone for a year and a half and it just things just didn't work out. Nice. So I have a chance then. <laughs> Maybe. So what about you? Are you seeing anybody? No, I'm not seeing anybody. I haven't for a while now. So I have a chance then. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> so you're aware that I have a child, right? Yeah, I mean, I don't have a problem with it. It's not really easy dating someone that has a kid, so I just wanted to prepare you for it. I think I can handle it. I think I'm good around kids. I'll be the judge of that. So, where's Isaac's father at in your life? We're just civil friends. Gotcha. So I wouldn't have anything to worry about? No. I mean, we've had our differences, we've had our ups and downs, but 
I think we're at a good place right now, and I don't see that changing anytime soon. So we can definitely hang out some more. Mm -hmm. We'll see. If I'm lucky? If you're lucky. All right. I just got to the restaurant, and I got a text from Javi saying that the hostess has a note for me. Hi. I'm here for a note. Actually, here it is. Thanks. You're welcome. Almost found us. Walk out of the restaurant, make a right, go down to the steps, and follow the path down to the lake. Hurry, we missed you. Have an Isaac. Who was that? Look. Oh. Mommy, I got flowers <laughs> for you. You did get flowers. They got them oh. for mommy? Yeah. You did? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Give me a kiss. Thank you. Well, the real reason why I brought you out here was because this was your childhood. You were, you were raised here, and I felt like this was a part of your life I wasn't a part of. So I figured if I came out here, I felt like some way I'll be a part of it forever because you are my present now. So what I really want to know is if you'll... Oh my God. If you'll marry me. I don't know what to say. I don't know how this works. Are you happy? Yeah, I'm happy. I'm just like in shock. Isaac, look! Look what I got. Is it pretty? And I, Isaac helped you through all this? He helped me through all of it. We celebrate now. Even though Javi and I got married at the courthouse, we're planning a big wedding that's a few months away. And I have even more on my plate because I'm four months pregnant. And today is my baby shower. What time is it? So you, you know. I think it's like 10.30. I still don't even know what I'm wearing. I don't want people to think I'm having a girl since I'm wearing pink. <sighs> but then if I wear blue, I don't want people to think I'm having a boy either. Why are you waiting to find out? Do you, don't you want to know? No, that's how we do it around here. <sighs> you know I didn't find out with Isaac either. True. I never pictured myself with two different. kids by two different dads. What does he do with one of them? And we're married. Maybe we did it the right way this time. <laughs> Come on. Let's change your clothes. Boogie! Hi! Where did he go? What you doing, Boogie? You look a mess. Isaac, are you going to have a brother or are you going to have a sister? You have a sister. I'm going to have a girl? Yeah. One, two, three. And we gotta get ready, you gotta go party. Que guapo! Okay, come on. Say bye to mommy, say we'll see you soon. I love you. I love you. <laughs> bye, baby, I'll see you later. Where are we late? I just want to say, everybody, thank you all for coming out. It's a big day. Kale's having another baby. Kale, Javi, I just wanted to say congratulations on the new baby. We already love Isaac so much, and I know we're going to take care of you guys and the baby as well. We're always here if you guys ever need anything, and we love you. Congratulations. If I can have everybody's attention one more time. I just want to thank everybody for celebrating this special day for um, Kale and myself. And it really is, it's a dream come true, um, meeting Kale, and she brought Isaac into my life. So as much as I want to celebrate having a baby, I already had one, and now we're just having two. I love you very much. I'm excited for this new baby. <laughs> Are you going to walk with me?
Good evening. On behalf of Jose and Kaylin, I would like to welcome you to this joyous celebration. Who gives this woman to be married to this man? I am. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Your marriage begins with your vows and promise to each other. Jose and Kaylin have decided to write their own vows, which they will share with each other now. Kaylin, the day is finally here. The day we promise each other to make it past any obstacle that comes our way. I tell you all the time that when we made eye contact two years ago, I knew there was something between us. Now I'm worthy enough to stand up here holding both of your hands. I promise to support and accept all of you because that's who I fell in love with. I promise to always be on your side no matter where we end up. I promise to give you my all. We've cried together, we've laughed together, and we've always been one. I promise to love you way past forever. Javi, we've waited for this day for so long, and it's finally here. In two years, we've gone through things that have tested our relationship and our own personal limits, but we've also grown together and learned to be patient. I'm forever thankful that you've accepted and taken Isaac in as your own. The bond that you two have is indescribable, but is seen by anyone who is around. I could not have dreamed of a better father figure and life partner. We have become one, and this time, in front of all of our friends and family, I still promise to accept and love all of our flaws and imperfections and vow to never try to change who you are. I promise to embrace your culture and celebrate your Guatemalan pride. I still promise to be faithful and show my support and all of my encouragement in everything you do. Yeah. You have my unconditional love. I still promise you forever. Please repeat after me. Kaylin, I give you this ring. Kaylin, I give you this ring. As a symbol of our vows. As a symbol of our vows. Please wear it as a sign to the world. Please wear it as a sign to the world. That you are my wife. That you are my wife. With this ring, I marry you. With this ring, I marry you. Can I see my finger? Jose, I give you this ring. Jose, I give you this ring. As a symbol of our vows. As a symbol of our vows. Please wear it as a sign to the world. Please wear it as a sign to the world. That you are my husband. That you are my husband. With this ring, I marry you. With this ring, I marry you. By the power vested in me, I am honored to pronounce that Jose and Kaylin are husband and wife. Jose, you may kiss your bride. Woo. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, may I introduce for the first time Mr. and Mrs. Jose Maraquin. Last night, I started having contractions, so Javi and Peach drove me to the hospital. Woo! Going to the hospital. <laughs> and after over 16 hours of labor, Lincoln Marshall was born. Javi went to pick up Isaac so he could meet his baby brother for the first time. Now put your arms out. <laughs> no. <laughs> like this. No, like hold, this. Hold up. Like this. Yep. There you go. There you go. Look. That's your little brother. Mommy, look. He's a baby. You know what his name is? Yeah. Can you say Lincoln? That's your brother Lincoln. That's baby Lincoln. Look at his eyes. His eyes. His eyes. You see his eyes? Yes. You're my baby, and Lincoln's my baby. No, Look, he's, he's my baby. Oh, he's not mine? No. Ew. Mommy, his hair is disgusting. Oh. Sorry. It'll it'll we'll clean it later. Yeah, yeah. I'm frustrated that Javi didn't bring Lincoln to me earlier, and now I have to take him to my birthday dinner so I can feed him in case we go out after. Hi, 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 oh, hi, hi. Oh, hi. Sorry, hi. thanks for showing up an hour late. Yeah. Where are you going? Oh, I have to feed him. I don't know where am I you? I want to save the milk in case we decided to go out. I didn't know what we were doing. I don't know what that means. What do you mean save the milk? Like, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Listen to this. I ordered mojito. She forgot the mint. It's the most important part of a mojito. It is a mojito. Know. That's what makes it a mojito. I don't even know about drinking. Would you feel so like right? this mojito's <laughs> not mint in it? Do you want a drink? No, uh-uh. I think, I think he's him. farting. He probably is hungry. Are you going to feed him out of your nipple? Yeah. True. With the, the smock over me. And you eat awesome. so fast because you haven't eaten? Mean, like I pick his nose right all day now. long. Thank you so much. Anyway, 
So how's everything in Delaware? It's fine. It's a little boring and lonely sometimes. What's going on tonight? After this, are we doing anything or do you just want to kind of... Kaylin, it's your first birthday where you're not pregnant. And I'm legal. And you're not legal. pregnant and legal. At the same time. I want to go out, but I have average. kids and I don't, you know what I mean? Oh. Like I have kids and I shouldn't be going to the club. But I pumped milk just in case we decided to go out. It's your birthday. But, but, Having kids are no, no, no. a disability. No, you guys are getting me, getting me wrong. Lincoln's still young. Like I don't know how I feel about leaving him for so long and I don't know what time we'd be home. Yeah. I don't know. But like you said, you've never done it before. It's not like you're doing it all the time and it's just some random occasion. Like you've never gone to a club before, so if you were gonna go, like your birthday now would be the time. time to do it. And if you go out and you decide you wanna go home, like okay. All rule in favor. Kaylin? What? We're Wait, all ruling in favor. Are you okay with me going out? I am. I'm okay with it. <laughs> I can, go out. Why don't I can go out. I can go out. All right, I'm ready to go. I'm right, ready. Me too. Thank you guys so much for this. Can't wait. Yeah. wait. First time officially going, going out, out, together. out together. All of us. All of us. Raising two kids is a challenge. And when Javi and I talked at the reunion, it made me even more confused about our relationship. I want my family together more than anything in this world. I don't feel like we have the same goals and views. Since then, we haven't really discussed our issues, but he still calls the kids. I miss you guys so much. I love tomorrow. I'm scared of what might happen, but trying to stay busy. I'm, I'm jumping out of a plane. Woo -woo. Some people dye their hair when they go through changes in life. Some people jump out of planes. It's a quarter life crisis. This is a quarter life crisis. This is exactly what I said. The nerves are starting to set in. <laughs> I'm gonna make it simple. Legs back, legs up. Legs back, legs That's up. That's your only job today. Okay. Does that Got sound it. good enough? Yeah, okay. You ready to do this? I'm ready. Yeah. I'm ready. Let's do it. <laughs> I'm gonna grab gear and we'll be ready to rock and roll. Okay. Let's do it to it. Woo! All right, Dan, you ready to do this, bud? I'm freaking out a little bit. You ready to do this? Okay. Yep. Follow the guy with the stairs, okay? Watch the I'm gonna <laughs> barf. <laughs> Fives anyway, look. I'm a still one later. Move over, move over. <laughs> he sound mad. He sound mad. <laughs> I heard him growling. <laughs> I'm scared for summer classes because yeah, I have boy. a Yeah boy. So, I have a one to five. Oh no. Class. Uh, no. What is it? They, they I have physics <laughs> and math over the summer. Mm -hmm. I have to take these classes this, this summer to graduate in December. Dr. Drew said I'll be the only teen mom on the whole franchise that graduated with a four-year degree. I just want to prove it to myself. That's it. What are you proving? My mom didn't go to college, so I wanted to go to college. Just because. I don't know, I feel like that's the only way I would have a purpose in life. And then I got pregnant and I was like, oh, like what am I gonna do with my life now? So for summertime, 
We're gonna take four classes for the summer. Once I take all these classes right here, these are all that I have left. And then I'm done. Then I'm done. Then I, mommy went to college. What do you think about that? I'm taking Isaac to Hobbies because he asked to spend the night there. Plus, I have a ton of schoolwork to do. Thank you. Hi, babe. I, I, yeah, I did. Isaac, you gotta put your seatbelt on. I already took off. I already started driving. Put your seatbelt on, babe. Um, I made this math paper mm -hmm. for my um friend. Mm -hmm. And and she's not really good at math, so I made her a paper so she can practice. Oh, that was nice of you to help her. Oh my God, I don't feel good. Isaac, I don't feel good. I just need to take a nap and do my my test. I have a test that I have to hand in tomorrow. What? Yeah. All right, come on. Give me a kiss, boy. Mwah. All right, come here. Give me a kiss. Bye, 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 bye. I love you. Bye, bye. Love you guys. <laughs> bye, bye. Bye, bye. What are you doing? Seeing Mila. What are you doing? I just took Isaac over to to Javi's house, and I have so much that I need to do tonight for tomorrow, but I'm so overwhelmed and frustrated right now. Like, I'm so tired. Dude, you're so pregnant. I'm so weak. For the candidates, please stand and come forward to the stage for public recognition. are on their way over to see the baby. Hello. Hi. Is my baby butter out? <laughs> Where is him? <gasps> is he asleep? He's eating. Are you so excited? You are. <laughs> He's so, you're so happy. <laughs> you are. Come here. Come sit up here. What do you think? You're so big to me now. He's coming right now. I do have two babies. No, Wait, no, no. One is but there's other one. No, I'm just still fat. <laughs> I'm just still really fat. What should we name him? He still doesn't have a name. Climber. You can call him Climber right now, but he doesn't have a name. I missed you. Give me a hug and a kiss. You're so, you feel so big to me now that he's here. But you know what? You were the biggest baby I had. He was smaller than you. What are you coming at? 7.15. You were 8'6". You were so big. You were 8 pounds, 6 ounces. And I didn't, I couldn't get an epidural or anything. Why not? I gave birth in two hours from oh. start to finish. Good. My water broke at 1.30 a.m. And I gave birth to him at 3 a.m. A lot different than right the other two, huh? I begged for an epidural. They were like, 
There's no There's time. There's another tree house. How's it feel? Um, good. Feels good? Yeah, I think so. Hello. Hi. There's Isaac. Hello. Isaac. Hey. Is that the baby? Yeah. Oh, I brought the whole fam, bam. Okay. For the baby? Uh-huh. And me? No. <laughs> I know. Who are you? Oh. Vivi's here. Go see Vivi. Go say hi to Vivi. Go, go see the baby. Okay, I brought like a ton of food. I made rice and beans and... Well, thank you. <laughs> He's so cute. Oh, my God. You hungry? There's food enough for everybody. You want some? Not yet. There's chicken and rice. So you didn't feel like any contractions like before that or yeah, anything? Yeah, they were off. When my water broke at 1.30, mm -hmm. my contractions were coming three minutes apart. But considering how fast and crazy it happened, it is it is good that Chris was able to like, does that make sense? It's not like there was eight hours for us to be like, okay, like things are happening. Mm -hmm. But he, I have to say, he did a good job. Like, I, he pushed on my back when I had a contraction. Yeah. He let me, like, squeeze. I was, like, yeah. squeezing. Better he have. let me, no, he was he was good about it. Look at his hand. Here, put your. Hey, I want to hold it. OK, so you want to come sit down and hold him? Here, come sit right here. Hey, did you get a name yet? No, he doesn't have a name. I, I still don't have no. a name. <laughs> what are you waiting for, girl? Here, put your legs down, babe. And also, don't be rough, okay? Lincoln. Give him a kiss. Oh. 